for me, uh, it's a very easy um, ROI. You know, you can never underinvest in your future talent, in your future leaders. Uh, for me, that investment has huge upsides as they grow, as they develop, as you retain them in the, within the organization. Yeah, my name is Nick Walker. I'm the Chief HR Officer of Paysafe Group. Paysafe Group is a specialized payments company with a global footprint, 3,500 people. Uh, I'm based in London and I've been here for, for nine years. Yeah, the, the Paysafe Front Runner Initiative is a high potential program uh, designed to identify and capture the, 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 the high performing individuals the young talent within the organization that has high potential. Uh, the, 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 the trick um, and the, the value in the program is really trying to identify people from all over the world. We're an international business, identify people from India, from the US, from Canada, from, from, from Europe. Uh, once they've identified, it's really to bring them together, uh, both in a virtual, but also in a physical uh, presence, uh, training, tra training environments, uh, and try to help them um, carve out a career, a leadership career, to give them the leadership skills that they need uh, to, to be able to um, drive their career forward. Uh, and Sim Service was one component of that, of, of that solution, ultimately. Yeah, we, we wanted to develop a front runner program um, that wasn't like off the shelf. We wanted to really pick and choose the best products, the best solutions out there in the marketplace and bring them together to create a wonderful solution for our uh, employees, our front runners, our high potential employees. And uh, when we went to market to look for something that would um, simulate a business environment, there's, of course, there's a number of solutions out there. What I liked about this industry was their pragmatism. Uh, I liked the fact that it was, very, it was a very commercially driven program. It was very adaptable. Uh, and also it was very, um, very innovative from my perspective. It really did bring all of those facets of a leadership program for young people together in one kind of one final big bang solution. Uh, so I really like that. And, and, and you know, Paysaver is a very innovative, young, um, fast moving, uh, edgy, gritty company. And I felt I got the same with Sindustry. They were listening. Uh, they were open, they were uh, able to adapt their solution to fit our actual needs. The Sindustry um, platform and the, the, the business simulation uh, offering that we, that we use in Paysafe, I've seen it now play out in a number of occasions. I've watched uh, 12 to 15 people in groups uh, go through this business simulation. It's tough, it's tough. Uh, and it's uh, sometimes painful to watch because people, uh, you know, young, young uh, high potentials are, are leveraging all of their skills in a very, in, in a very kind of almost live environment. It's very stressful. Um, it, it's, it's, it feels very real. Uh, and, you know, outside looking in, it's a perfect way to assess how uh, a future leader can adapt, uh, can problem solve, can collaborate, can work with others, can communicate with others. Uh, it's, for me, it's, it's, it's the perfect scenario where you, you're in a safe working environment. You're not exposing your company in any way because it's simulated. But there's no better way to see how a team of, leader, of potential leaders work together and really to identify those that um, shine and that outshine others. Yeah, the Front Runner program, our high potential program, was actually very much a, um, a physical presence training solution uh, pre-COVID, uh, where we invited people from all over the world to meet uh, probably four times a year to go through four specific leadership training modules. The last one being the sim service uh, business simulation module. Uh, then obviously COVID hit. So we had to quickly pivot what was um, a, a kind of a face-to-face -face training um, solution into a remote training solution. Uh, and my fear was that we would, we would lose the magic touch of that um, the idea of, of, of bringing cultures together, bringing people together, getting them to collaborate, getting them to learn together, getting them to solve together.
So I was really nervous about how we would manage that in a, in a remote working environment. But uh, we, we did. We pivoted to, remote, to, to, to a remote training program, a leadership program uh, over the Internet. Uh, and Sim Service equally pivoted their solution from what was a very much a, a face to face training solution into, into something that could be uh, operated uh, in a virtual um, in, in a remote environment. And it's worked really well, actually. I, I was I was skeptical to begin with. But having seen now a number of our teams go through the sim service business simulation in a remote basis, it really works. It really does work. So in, in, ter in terms of the return on investment for sim industry and the, the, the sim service platform, the, the, the business simulation, for me, uh, it's a very easy um, ROI, you know, you can never underinvest in your future talent, in your future leaders. Uh, for me, that investment has huge upsides as they grow, as they develop, as you retain them in the, within the organization. So the ability to use Simdustry and Sim Service as a, a gateway for a young high potential um, in terms of a gateway into leadership, for me, you can't put a value on that. It's, uh, it, it's, it's something that for me um, is, um, is a given in the organization.